Hey everyone, welcome back to the long dark hardcore dead man starting episode two um, Last episode we got into the paradise meadows farm um, and We're approaching evening time and we're getting pretty tired here. Um, so I got to get my head back in the game um, Yeah, we still do have to search this place. So let's go ahead and do that Take the water. We'll take a little bit of an inventory check too before we go to bed um, But yeah Last episode. Oh, there's a flare. Awesome. So we're gonna probably use that on the way out of here. The last episode we did spawn in here in Mountain Town. Um, tried our best to survive. Didn't lose too much condition, so definitely a little bit happy about that. Um, but we made it through the town, made it through some wolves, and we're here now. So that's always good. Always good to be alive. So we're gonna go over here. We're super, super tired. So we'll try to loot out this room as best as we can. It is a little cold in here surprisingly oh nice there's some oh yeah right we get the work gloves which are better go ahead and see if we don't have anything on yep we have everything on okay but yeah so it's not oh there's a mag lens awesome super awesome to have it's not super warm in here like i was saying we'll put that on in a second 31 maybe with that dress shirt we'll be above 32 32 is the freezing mark so we'll have to see gonna take everything for now and we'll sort it all out when we uh when we have time to see what's in here nothing all right yes yeah, so let's go ahead i want to drop the rabbit pelts too can't forget that cannot forget that nice we're up to 32 in here but we're not losing temperature that quickly go ahead and put our pelts down all right what are we carrying here 82 pounds uh yeah that's a little heavy is a little heavy i would say so let's go ahead and just drop some stuff in here do a little bit of inventory management before we go to bed here we have a little time um practical gunsmithing that's useless same with that one pretty useless to us so we're not going to read it wilderness kitchen that might be something we want to hang on to we'll go ahead and hang on to that one put some of those books away uh police mittens we'll put away as well and we're wearing everything else in our inventory. Very nice. All right. So. Uh, we'll have to see if we need to eat anything first. Make sure we just don't get tired. That's the most important thing. We do have a lot of water too, which is weighing us down. So that's okay. I don't mind that problem. Okay. Let's go ahead and just put one in for now. I'd like to see what the. What the house is like. In terms of getting back some temperature. Nice. Yep. So that's a that's a warm bed right there. Nine degrees. Okay. Cool. So you can see a little bit. I think we're going to go ahead and just sleep through the night. Really no incentive to wander around here in the dark. Um, in the morning, we'll get our buffs ready and we will head on out. I'm going to put in four hours. This is going to be more of a paranoia thing. I know I could probably sleep, you know, six or seven hours safely, but I'm not, lo I'm not losing this run to something super stupid. So, we're going to take our time here. We'll do another two hours. Got to keep tabs on that water. That thirst likes to go really, really fast, so. But yeah, like I was saying last episode, your water goes really fast, you know? You, you always have to keep moving. Um, we'll go ahead and eat that. I'm going to pass on the sketchy stuff. So, I would consider that sketchy. Um, this is okay. Let's go ahead and open that. But uh, Yeah, I'm not eating anything that's well into the orange. Kind of seems like a bad idea. And we don't have any antibiotics on us, so that's another thing. Alright, let's put in three. <laughs> Getting a little brave with three hours here, but... Yeah, alright. There's a blizzard. Hey, that's not a bad time to get a blizzard, to be honest. Uh, I'll put it in three hours. Not a bad time to get a blizzard at all. So we'll spend the morning just looting the rest of this place. Um, yeah, awesome. We're going to want to get a fire going as well, so I think I'll probably do that right now. We have a ton of books and stuff. Let's go ahead and actually start it with a lot of the books in here. That's a good idea. We'll make use of it. All right. Uh, I think the fireplace is over here somewhere. Let's get back. Then 
There's the fridge. Yep. So the stove is right here. Cool. Okay. So let's go ahead and light one of our torches here. Whoops. There we go. Oh, wow. Light is quite a nice thing, I must say. Go ahead and start that up. We're just going to throw all the books on it. I think I want to carry maybe three or four books on me. Just because they are really good for starting fires. I believe they give you highest percentage um, baseline chance anyway to start a fire. So, Alright, go ahead and put that out. Probably just tear that torch down later. Okay. One, two, three. Start with that for now. Maybe we'll put in some sticks as well. Okay. Go ahead and get that torch up again. So we can at least, you know, see what we're doing. Um, the water, I don't really need right now. So this is more just going to be excess material. It's fine, though. When in doubt, make water. We'll get this can going as well. Can't forget to pick those up, though. All right, let's go ahead and do some searching around this place. Um, it'd be nice to find some better, better uh, clothing. But I've kind of accepted that better clothing is pretty redundant considering it's super, super heavy. Or not super heavy. The weather's going to be super bad, so it's kind of irrelevant to have really good clothing. Because that wind is just going to pierce through you anyway. Uh, okay, that's good. Alright, um, well, that's empty. That's empty as well. All right, let's go ahead and search the office over here. Some more books we can throw into the fire. Ah, oh, that's a lot of books. That is quite a bit of reading there. All right. New fleece mittens. That might actually be better than what we have, but I'm pretty sure once we fully repair those work gloves, oops. Once we fully repair those work gloves, they're gonna be much better than the fleece. Whoops, already searched that. Okay. Alright, let's get back to the fire here. And we'll put... Five books on. Seems pretty good. Uh, five minutes left on the melting of the snow. One minute there. Let's do that. Okay. So I'm gonna... Tear that down, and I'm gonna go ahead and put the T's down as well. Um... Just because I think our next move is going to be going into Mystery Lake. Oh, we don't have any buffs, do we? We don't have any teas or stuff. That's interesting. Okay, let's go ahead and just put the coffee down. And I guess I'll go ahead and and make a rose hip tea. Yeah, we don't have many uh, many resources right now. Can we craft anything? Okay, yes we can. Great. That's good. That's what you like to see. Um, that coffee's hot. That won't burn, which is good. Go ahead and craft another one. Perfect. And we'll put that there. That's 10 minutes for that. So that, that is about 15 minutes we can, we can spend. Cool. And we'll put that in there as well. Now let's drop our... Or teas. Okay, great. Then I'll take that. Yeah, the food situation, huh? Let's go ahead and eat that. I know food poisoning could probably be a really big issue, but you kind of got to gamble in this game mode, you know? Got to gamble a little bit. All right. I'm going to just go ahead and keep that on us because that's going to be our antibiotics in case we get food poisoning. So that's going to be good to have. Just in case. Go ahead and just take these back. I don't see myself making any more water. We've got plenty. Plus a soda as well. Okay. So all there's a pot. I think what we might actually do is go sleep an hour. It seems a little crazy, but we're going to want to keep our energy maxed out as long as we can. To go ahead and travel when it's nice and warm outside. So that's kind of my thinking behind it. We'll sleep an hour here. Nice and the weather seemed like it calmed a little bit. Nah, still get still get that uh 
pretty harsh blizzard sound. All right. Okay. All those are still hot. Amazing. All right, we got quite a bit of fuel on that fire, so I'm feeling I'm feeling pretty good about that. I think we'll go ahead and sleep one hour. Oh, not tired enough. Okay. Um, if we pass real quick. There we go. I think now. Yep. Cool. Alright. So, I mean, if the weather looks good outside... Granted, it's still late morning. No, it's not going to look good outside at all. Let's just go ahead and take a peek. Oh, no way. Alright, well, I mean... It's sunny at least, right? That's a plus. So I'm thinking maybe for, um, can I reach the rose hips? No. I'm thinking maybe for our way out, we're going to go more towards the right or the left rather, um, towards the barn and maybe skirt around that way. We do have the buffs to do it. We have the tees. I don't really want to use them. We don't have to, but we might have to. So we're going to wait for this wind to calm down. I'm even going to drink the soda because it's heavy. Give us a little food back. Awesome. And how are we looking for Tinder? Tinder, Tinder. Uh, 10. Well, I mean, it's a start. Definitely a start. Just waiting for this wind to, to chill out. I think it might have chilled out. Go ahead and take a peek. Wow, that's a perfect day. I think we should move on it, to be honest. We should most definitely move on that. Um, I just really want to purge my inventory first. Uh, I'm going to drop that. I'm going to drop that. Don't need it. I'm going to go ahead and take a few torches. I'm not going to take all of them. Probably leave this fire running quite a bit. Because we are overweight. And, uh, screw that torch. Come on now. We're here for the good stuff. There we go. A little better. That's, uh... That's alright. But yes, like I said, we should definitely move on that. I mean, sunny day, no wind. It'd be silly not to. Alright, so now we're for sure... Yeah, we're for sure overweight. That torch can go away. Um, even these 20% can go. Light that real quick. Okay, cool. Go ahead and take those, and we're off. Anything real quick we want to drop? Uh, extra pot? No thanks. Uh, lamp? Fuel? No thanks. Um, Alright, we don't have time to, to be fooling around. Let's get out of here. Okay. Ah, uh, it got windy. Yikes. Yeah, that, that's a little unfortunate, actually. Oh, no, no, no. That didn't just happen. That did not just happen. Just wasted a match. Alright. That's okay. That's alright. There's plenty of matches in the world. We're fine. Um, I don't think it's the time to leave, though. I can tell you what. It's probably not the time to leave. It just got really, uh... Oh, no way! These torches are still burning! Oh my gosh. Okay. That's that's pretty lucky. I, I do have to say that, that that's pretty lucky. Maybe, maybe I uh, maybe I was too quick to misjudge those torches. But yeah, what happened out there? If you missed it, um, I went to go collect a rose hip with the um, with the torch in my hand, and I accidentally wasted a match. It happens all the time. Even when I'm carrying a gun in stalker mode, it happens. I accidentally fire it, and uh, you know. Super annoying, but it, it does happen. So, looking at nine matches here, so we do have to be a little bit careful of what we wanna, what we wanna spend, if, if you, uh, if you will. All right, now the wind's calming down, and I don't trust it. Go ahead and just toss that in there. Practical gunsmithing. Toss that in there. Keep the wilderness kitchen on us. All right, I'm gonna drop the teas. I'm gonna drop them again. It'll stay here. Awesome, 10 minutes. Not bad. But I really do want to get out of here. I don't want to stay. I don't want to stick around. 
we should move while the weather's good. But, you know, if I go outside and it starts becoming windy again, that's not, that's not nice, you know? I'm just gonna stay out here and maybe chill out a little bit. Uh, looks like, where's the wolves? Hmm. Oh, that's the wind picking up. All right, though. It, I mean, it seems fine. It seems fine to go. Um, probably going to head that way. I want to go more towards the Mystery Lake area. Uh, I wouldn't mind going past the Orca gas station as well. That could be definitely something we do. Um, okay. Let's go ahead and get a move on. I'm going to pass on all that stuff. Uh, that stuff can stay there as well. All right. That's, an, that's a little unfortunate. I do have to, I do have to say, it's a little unfortunate that we, number one, wasted a match, but number two are not fully, uh, are not fully warm. So we're going to have to drink a tea here pretty soon. Okay, let's make our way through here. I'm going to go out on a limb and say there's going to be no wolves in our way, but, oh, that's immediately debunked. That theory is thrown out the window. Uh, why did I drink the water, you know? Oh, no, that's that's um, the mailbox I'm seeing. Whoops. Yeah, I j just saw the mailbox there. I, I think we're okay. All right, let's go ahead and drink one of our teas. Really, really can't afford to be cold. You know what I mean? We just can't. And there's a deer there, and I want to harvest him so bad, but we got to resist, you know what I'm saying? We just have to. Got to keep moving, so let's go ahead and do that. Now, before I jinx myself, I will say that in my past experiences, it's been a pretty easy walk from here to the climbing area or Mystery Lake. And a pre pretty relaxed walk in the runs that I've done. So hopefully it's the same way, but I think we're gonna stop by the Orca gas station. That way we can get some food, get some water and just kind of chill out maybe for the night, perhaps. So we might go ahead and do that as well. Overall, such a nice day though. I do have the slightest suspicion that the wind will kick up. So that's gonna be a little unfortunate, but it's okay. Deal with it when it happens, right? All right. Okay. Let's go ahead and replace our torches. And we'll get on the move on pretty quick before we outstay our welcome here. Uh, that is a deer over there. So over there seems a little safer. All right. Let's head up here. Yeah, that climbing rope is going to be a bit of a challenge. Um, usually what I would do if we're playing, you know, a mode other than this is just to scale down. Oh, that scared me, but that's a deer. So we're fine. Um, usually I would scale down the rope. I wouldn't even climb the rope, you know, but I'm sure as heck not doing that today. Or when we do climb the rope. No way. We're just going to stay to the book here and try to not lose condition. It's such a nice day, though. Look at this temperature. There's one arrow down. That's awesome. That's what you always want to see. All right. This is where things can get a little hairy. Um, it, literally, too. Um, there can sometimes be wolves over here. I'm not hearing any right now, but that sure doesn't mean they're not there. Oh, yeah. Look at the wolf right there. Oh, dude's in our way. There's a whole pack, too. Um, I don't know, man. I don't know, man. The, the the gas station, it would be super nice to get. There's a lot of food that can be had there, but I just don't think it's going to be for us today. Yeah, I, I just don't think so. I think what we should instead try to focus on is getting those rabbits down there. That's probably a good idea. Getting those rabbits and then getting into the the hut there to cook them. We gotta take every every single piece of food we can find, you know? So. Come on. There we go. 
so afraid of misclicking and accidentally using a match. I'm so good at that. Okay. Awesome. Cool to be here, I guess. We'll go ahead and start. Start our fire up. I don't think it's warm in here either without a fire. So that's maybe something to think about. I, I really, really do want to go get those rabbits and take their hides. Oh, we didn't pick up the hides, did we? Nope, we didn't. Okay. Just one problem after another, man. I'll tell ya. Yeah, didn't pick them up. Nope. That's unfortunate. And guess what? We ain't going back. <laughs> we are not going back, so... That's okay. That's alright. It's a live and learn experience here in, uh, in Dead Man. Just makes you better when you forget something. Um, okay. Uh, hour on the fire. I don't really trust it, so I'm gonna go ahead and put... Yeah, about an hour and a half. That, that works for me. Let's go ahead and grab these rabbits. Um... We'll go get our two alts back, hopefully, from these guys. But we do have to be careful um, of the wolf we saw on the way in here. Once we pick up our rabbit, he will be on our case. Hey, look, there's a deer here as well. So maybe that could be good. That could definitely be a good thing. So that deer hurt us before the rabbits did, which is awesome. Rabbit's trying to play in the tall grass. See if we can eh, we'll play that game too. Awesome. All right. Oh, there's another rabbit. I don't think he heard his. Uh, I don't think he heard his buddy. I think he heard the deer though. Okay. Let's go ahead and take this. Okay. Looks like that wolf is going for for one of those. Wasn't a good idea to put the rabbit in the tall grass, but it's okay. We persevered. Now let's go ahead and walk it. See how long we can get away with it. Until we see a wolf. Really not trying to burn too much energy with this, but it does kind of seem like it. Like we're going to have to anyway. It'd be nice to maybe start traveling. It'd be really nice to start traveling around night. That could be good. What time of day? Uh, early afternoon. Yeah, we, I mean, we could definitely. It's within reason, right? Uh, nine hours, or <laughs> nine hours, an hour and nine minutes. That would be a good fire, nine hours, huh? I'd pay for one right now. All right, so let's go ahead and put this guy on the, whoops. Put him on the fire. We can wait 15 minutes. We'll do the other one. We should be okay in terms of hunger. Man, I can't believe I left those pelts there. That's fine. It's a learning experience, right? Live and learn. Uh, yep. Raw rabbit. Put that there. Oops. Come on. Got a tight schedule. Um, I'll even put one of those on. Alright. Do 15 minutes there. Man, the hacksaw is going to be a game changer, huh? Can't wait to find that thing. Go ahead and eat that. Yeah, these are small snacks. I mean, it's not much, but it's honest work. <laughs> um, yeah, we'll go ahead and do that one. that. Take you. Put you back on. Nice. That's going to be eight minutes. We'll go see what the other rabbit, other piece of rabbit is. Um, you done? No. Six minutes. Yeah, we can do that. Awesome. That worked out awesome. Um, I may even tear down their pelts in a minute. That's going to be six minutes. Cool. Do that. And that's going to be six minutes as well, I think. Eight minutes. Close enough. All right. Put all those sticks on. It is very windy. It's not really something I want to travel in. But, I don't know. I mean, it could be fine. We're only going down a rope and into a cave. So, in theory, some T's should be able to cover that distance. Um, yeah, I'm glad I didn't do that just now. Okay. So what are we looking at for weight? All right, hour 39. Let's go ahead and do 40 minutes of that. It's going to be super crucial to get these rabbit pelts going. Eat one of those. Because they are, in a way, going to be the lifeline. At least later on. Whoops. All right, we'll do another 40 minutes. I wouldn't even mind tearing down that crate over there for some reclaimed. 
Eat that. All right, we got our two rabbit pelts back, so no sweat there. Um, it's not like we're, we're missing out on travel time anyway because of the wind, so. 13 minutes. Do that. Take that down. All right, is there anything here? Yeah, it doesn't seem like it. All right. 35 minutes on the fire. Search all these drawers. Usually there's... Okay, yeah, I was going to say. Usually there's some small food. And sometimes you can even find, I think, a wool tube I found. Hey, that's good. That's not bad. Scrap metal. I'm okay with the scrap metal. We'll find more down the line when we're ready to forage. Newsprint. I'm all set. A flare shell. Um, that's a little interesting. That's almost a little buggy. I don't think there should be a flare shell. Um, I'm actually just going to go ahead and leave the flare shell because... Actually, no. No, no, no. Take that. Take that. I forgot. I think there can be distress pistols in this uh, in this mode. We'll go ahead and take that. 26 on the fire. It's not like we can take a torch outside. Only thing left on these are the guts, and I'm okay on the guts. So let's go ahead and drop our tees. Oh, yeah, so we only have one. Okay. 15 minutes, eh? Don't have any more. Um, okay, we'll drop a, a coffee. 20 minutes. Put a little bit more on. Maybe 40 is good. Oh, nice. Wind is calming down for us. All right, time to move is now. You guys know the drill. Let's go ahead and uh, and take advantage of this nice calmness here. Go ahead and take some rocks as well. I think we use them all. Two down, really. Two down for late in the day. That's, that's pretty cold. That is pretty cold, but it, it just signifies the importance of having to move, right? Um, okay, so, I'm really trying to think right now, and I really, really think that, no, wait, hold on, I'm trying to think this through right now, for once, trying to think a plan through, we cannot go down into the cave, and the reason because, is because there's no bed, there's no bed, and we'll be stuck down there, yeah, no bedroll, so we do have to sleep here, unfortunately, but I guess in a way it's fortunate, because we do have a we do have a fireplace we have a nice somewhat warm bed i think we need to take advantage of this and just get as much sticks as we can to support this fire so let's go ahead and just do do our rounds here we'll get a few sticks going yeah now now i kind of do regret um not keeping some of that firewood on us just kind of spending it like the books the books would have been really nice to have now but, oh well. Like I said throughout this episode, it's a live and learn experience. Alright, there's nowhere that way. Looks like we do have the wind kicking up. I'm gonna go ahead and head back here. Pick up more sticks. Might even just come out here and break some of these bigger ones down. That could be good. But ultimately, I do want this torch to survive and carry us through the night at least until we can start a fire right so i think the best bet is maybe just to leave it here for now um, i'll even hook it up with another nice torch and let's just go out on our own and get some sticks so we'll have this torch in case we want to start a fire 36 in here so i have a feeling we're gonna want to keep that fire going all night if we can all right Yeah, not really, just nothing. A bunch of nothingness here. A stick over here we could do. Okay. Alright, so while I'm thinking about this, I actually do have a, a change of plans, I think, that I want to do right now. I think right now we should probably sleep. We need to sleep through this warmest time of day, because when it's really cold, we're not going to be able to sleep. So unfortunately, we are going to let this torch go out. I think that's probably the best move. I don't want to keep feeding wood into it when I know for sure that it's not going to survive the night. So let's go ahead and just eat something. Um, what can we get rid of? I'm not doing those two or the tomato soup. 
Well, let's just go ahead and do cattails. That's fine. Take us down to five cattails, and then I'll smash open maybe the peaches right now, actually. Peaches are heavy. Don't really want to be carrying them anyway. Awesome. Maybe we'll throw back some crackers as well. Cool. All right. So, yeah. We'll sleep through the night, right? Or sleep through the, the early evening here. Just because it's nice and warm, you know? Well, let's go ahead and do two hours. Should warm us up nicely, but we do really have to watch the temperature tonight. I don't think I'm going to do longer than two hour stretches. Yeah. All right. Do two hours. See what happens. Ooh, an Aurora. That's pretty cool. That's really cool. Awesome. Super cool. Okay. Um, well, that doesn't really uh, affect us, really, too much. Just gonna keep sleeping here. Uh, I'm gonna put in probably just two hours. I think we'll get to a point where we might just do one hour at a time. Might be pretty soon. Okay. Yeah, look at that, huh? Wow. That's sick. Really awesome. Okay, so. It's midnight. Temperature's not warm, but it's warm enough to sleep maybe one more hour, two at most. But we'll do one hour at a time now. And I think we're just going to have to start a fire, to be honest. I think that's what's just going to happen. Um, so let's go over here and break down some wood. Yeah, we're losing temperature pretty quickly here. Uh, let's just do an inventory check. How many sticks do we have? 35. I'm going to go ahead and put the pelts down. I'm actually going to... I'm going to move them to the front entrance here so we don't forget them. 1% cured. Awesome. To start. Hopefully we don't miss them. Wouldn't surprise me if we do, though. All those are frozen. That's fine. That's an hour to tear down. No, thank you. That is also one hour. Okay. Um, yeah, it's going to be too cold to sleep anyway. So, let's see, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yeah, that's going to take us right to 32. So, can't be doing that. Um, all right, let's go ahead and just start up this fire. Harvest these first, though save some we're technically saving some firewood the longer we delay starting a fire so i'm gonna take a little bit of time just to break down these torches break down the 30 percent ones maybe if we have anything that's 15 minutes worth of crafting we could do but we are gonna want to start a fire and then sleep an hour or two after that um okay yeah anything we can do doesn't look like it though does not look like it. Okay. That is fine. Go ahead and take that. Yeah, might as well. Might as well. Having a surplus of tinder is better than having no tinder. Okay. So that's that. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and start this fire. Nine matches left, so... At least for now, we do have to be a little wary of what we use. Let's go ahead and do that. Perfect. Man, you know, it's stressful. It is stressful. That's what Dead Man is, though, you know? You gotta be on your toes and alert all the time. Little mistakes will cost you, whether it's short-term or long-term. So, us forgetting those two pelts there, luckily that's not the hugest deal because rabbits are pretty common, relatively speaking, in the long dark, but that could have easily been... Uh, something bad if we were relying on those rabbits earlier or later on you know so um let's go ahead and just put our teas down we got a coffee going as well i'm gonna have to climb two ropes tomorrow or later today i guess do that cool that's an hour 
might put a little bit more on. Take it down to 30. That's good. 10 minutes. Let's go ahead and just fast forward 10 minutes. Okay, perfect. Um, it's two hours. Would this be a mistake? I don't know. Let's try it. Okay, nice and warm. That wasn't too bad. And now we have more firewood, huh? That's awesome. So I think the plan now is we're going to want to sleep an hour. We're going to just take ourselves up to, uh, to full energy here. Gotta eat something, though, huh? Let's go ahead and take a chance on this. I really shouldn't be doing this, though. You know, anything below 40% to me is a real no-no. Um, because if we do get food poisoning, it's basically the end of the run. At least this early on. Staying behind, falling behind on the weather um, when we should be going. That's going to be very costly if we find ourselves in that situation. But try not to eat that type of food. Okay, two hours on that. Oh, that's good. Okay. Go ahead and just do an hour. We'll wake up, see how the teas are doing in the fire, and then we'll put in another hour. Hopefully that'll take us up to full. Oh, guys, I don't like that. A little scary. Zoinks. Um, okay. Okay. Um, another hour on that, so let's go ahead and just put another hour away. We're doing this for energy and saving food purposes, too, so you kind of get... It's a double win, basically. All right, getting a little breezy. This is probably going to go go over to a blizzard later on. Um, so in the meantime, let's go ahead and break down this chair for an hour. Awesome. Oh, no way. I thought I had an hour left on that. I guess I didn't. That, that could have been interesting, though. And I tell you what, I would have been not a happy person if that happened. Okay. Back up to two hours. We're fine. Everything's good. Um, coffees are still in, intact there. Or the teas, rather. Go ahead and sleep another hour. Okay. Um, so as bad as this weather looks, and it, uh, you know, it is bad. It's going to be pretty cold when we walk outside. Um, I'm very tempted to travel in this if it does turn directions, which I think it actually just did. Yeah, I actually just think it did. Um, because I want windshade when we're crawling down the rope, you know? Yeah, it, it's literally coming from this way now. Um, hmm. Tempted to climb. Super, super tempted to climb. I'm also pretty tempted because we have no more firewood in here. So, we are going to have to make a move pretty shortly here. What are we looking at? Um, okay. Ten cloth, that's good. A cup of coffee, a rose hip. You know, it, I'm super tempted to move now. Super tempted. It's, it, I just think it's a little bit too early in the day, though, to be to be moving like that. I think maybe I'll make another water. Yeah, look at our water. We're already down to two and a half. It's crazy. I'm not going to drink all of it. Go ahead and wait that out. Yeah, this is turning to blizzard. Definitely don't want to go down if it's doing that. Um, okay. Well, we're getting down to, to more sketchy stuff, I would say. I really don't want to eat that stuff, so we're going to have to get moving today, or, it, you know, <laughs> we're not making it through the night, basically. Go ahead and toss back some crackers as well. That gas station now seems like a really good idea, huh? Definitely seems like a top-tier gas station to go to, but... Unfortunately, we're going to have to uh, keep pushing on. We're, we're kind of dedicated now to going to uh, Mystery Lake. All right, hour and a half. That's fine. Go ahead and sleep an hour. Oh, not tired enough, really. All right. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, maybe go outside, take a look at what's going on. That's yeah, because of the fire. I was about to say, no way. That's more like it. All right, I'm seeing no sticks, which is unfortunate. Yeah. There's nothing. Not seeing anything. I don't want to stay out here longer than I have to. 
because of hunger reasons. Nice, nice and warm in here. All right, let's go ahead and, and do that hour we wanted to earlier. If this lightens up, I'm tempted to go. We do have coffee as well, so remember that. Uh, yeah, don't, don't really think we're gonna be going in this though. Gotta be honest. Yeah, that's uh, that's pretty wild. That is pretty wild. 44. Um, that's fine. 10 minutes on that. I'm gonna start tearing down some of my torches too. 30% good. Alright. We, we basically have two hours on the fire. Alright. Uh, 50 pounds, not bad either. Alright. Okay, well, I mean, there's really nothing else for us to do. Probably break down this paper for some tinder. Probably a good start. Might as well. Really hoping that this blizzard lets up. I should try not to move a lot, too, because I know that's going to take a lot of uh, food out of us as well. So we'll try our best not to move. Break down this tinder. Maybe we can sleep a little bit as well. Nope. Pass a little bit of time. There we go. Now sleep that away. Man, it's tedious. It is tedious work. I don't like that. 49 minutes. Okay. Put that down for 27. 26 minutes on the fire. Yikes. Hey, they really got us pinned down here. Okay, well. It's almost time to eat something again, so, I mean, we really gotta push. We really gotta go. My, maybe, maybe I'll backtrack to that gas station. That could be a, a good idea now, you know? Uh, I, I'd be really tempted to, to be honest. I'd be super tempted to. Like, right now. Right now, right now, you know? Um, it is just a quick sprint. I don't think there's any wolves out either. It's tempting, guys. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, we might have to do it. We might have to do it. I'm not a fan of it, but... If this doesn't, like, let up in the next hour... I'm going to do it. Hour nine minutes. Oh, I can't sleep. Hour two minutes. Oh, not tired enough? Come on. 59 minutes. Okay. Put one more on. The teas are hot. They're ready to go. Sleep one. Come on, Blizzard. Come on, Blizzard. Let up. Not going to release its grip. Okay, guys, um, this is going to be a make or break thing right here, you know? This is really going to, uh, going to test us. All right. All right, this is in the interest of food. We could, I guess, stay a little bit, but let's just go out, face the music. Let's go. Oh, we're losing temperature so fast. Oh my gosh. My gosh, guys. Was this a good idea, guys? Was this a good idea? Come on. Oh boy. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're in here now. That's good. It's good to be in here. I think we did the right thing. I think we did the right thing. Invisible newsprint. Hey, that's a <laughs> that's a good item, I guess. My gosh. Woo, boy. But hey, you know. Oh, oh my gosh, guys. It was totally worth it. We have a saw now. Let's go. Okay. All right. Woo, boy. 
Okay, um, I would love more warmer clothes because it doesn't seem too warm in here. Yeah, 30, so we're shy two degrees from warming up. Go ahead and open these. Hopefully we can get some clothing, but food is also really good. Um, okay. I would say we're still basically in the position to take everything. But we'll see here. Uh, anything here? It doesn't look like it. Bathroom usually has some things. Want to try to stay still while looting everything. Don't want to be wasting any uh, energy. Can I reach that? Nope. Okay. Go ahead and drink that. I thought I drank, drank uh, the tea there for a second. Oh boy. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I haven't been that stressed in... In a little bit, not gonna lie. All that looks empty. Beef jerky, nice. Nothing in there. Pack of papers, I'm good. More ketchup chips. Anything in here? Herbal tea would be nice. Nope. All right, yeah, I mean, it's slim pickings in here, but food is food, right? So even a little bit does help pretty happy about that and I believe there's a bed in here as well some dog food awesome it's a little heavy probably would have preferred um pork and beans but it's okay actually pork and beans might also be six uh point six pounds not sure all right well that seems like it that's it for the gas station pretty quick looting spot but like you saw I mean it's the difference between life and death right and I think I think this convenience store gave us life. Hey, there's a soda. Awesome. Anything in here? Might as well check. Nope. Doesn't look like anything's in there either. Okay. Alright. Cool. Yeah, awesome place to be. I would say the number one ticket we walk out of here with is the hacksaw. Just an awesome item to have. Um, so let's go ahead and sleep an hour. We'll warm up as well. Wait for this blizzard to clear up. Yeah, this is an all-day blizzard. I'm really glad we we made a move and moved in now because if we stuck around at that little uh, arc outpost, wouldn't have been good. Would not have been ideal. Okay, blizzard's still going. It's, it's in no rush. Forgot to search these drawers somehow. I did. Yeah, I searched that. Okay, cool. Got everything. Nice. I always like this spot. The Orca gas station, you know? It's unique. Definitely unique. Go ahead and just take a peek outside. I'm not going to stay out here for long. Alright. And that's all I need. Just a little taste. Cool. Alright, I'm going to stop moving, like I said, to preserve some calories. Go ahead and eat the candy bar. Yeah, a lot of this stuff is low condition, which is unfortunate, but... Food is food, I guess, at the end of the day, you know? Okay. So, maybe we read an hour, you know? Maybe we read The Wilderness Kitchen. It's gonna be an all-day blizzard. Of course it is. Well, at least now we have a shot at survival because of this gas station, so that's good. Come on, break already. There we go, guys. There's the break. Was that the break? Was that the break we needed? I think it was. Yes. Okay. All right. It's still a little post blizzardy, so I'm gonna go ahead and use this time to light a fire. Light a fire. That would be good. Um, two books left. You have to be a little bit mindful of that, but we've got to keep pressing on. Food is at such a premium right now, and especially with the kind of gross food that we have right now on us. We're going to want to get moving, you know? Alright, cool. We'll save this torch. Um, yikes, not a ton of firewood, though. Okay. Um, just toss one stick on. It's a little cheap, but what can you do? Um, okay, there's the other one. Cool. So, luckily, I don't think we're going to be needing to use the coffee right now. 
Uh, put another stick on. We probably won't need the coffee just because we are going. Oh, nice. Okay, let's move in this. But like I said, we're going down a rope and then up a rope, so we might need the coffee, but I just don't know if we will. Let's go ahead and take these, um, and let's get moving. We just gotta be careful there's no wolves here. That's really the only threat. Hello? Why is it like this now? That was an interesting weather change, and I'm not a fan of it. It's calm. Definitely calm. Um, I don't quite know what's going on here, so I'm just gonna keep moving. I gotta bring out the little, the little walk here. It's super warm out right now. What is it right now? 27. Yeah, that, that's awesome. Some really awesome post blizzard weather. Super cool. All right, well, let's go ahead and just check this truck. We do have the temperature luxury, so that's good. Oh, nice. It was worth it, too. Yeah, you know it's dead man when you when you start getting excited about moldy candy bars, you know? <laughs> it's what makes the game fun, right? It makes it interesting. I'm actually going to go out of the way, too, to pick up this stick. Seems a little odd, but we need firewood. Yeah, what is this, like, weird weather? It's almost like a combination between a blizzard and... Oh, is it blizzard? Is it going to blizzard on us? No. No, don't do that to me. Oh, you're joking. What? It just cleared up. Oh, my gosh, guys. Oh, my gosh. We got played. We got played. We got absolutely played. I cannot believe that. Okay. Just run. Just run. Let's run in here. Uh, there's more sticks on the ground. I'm going to go ahead and just pick them up. I can't believe that. We got clickbaited. We, get, we just got absolutely clickbaited. Okay. Um, that's not okay, actually, at all. That's just not okay. That's not even fair. We gotta start another fire. Alright, it doesn't look like it's blizzarding, though. I think it was just an interesting weather change. I, I think that's just all it was. But I'm gonna go ahead and start a fire anyway, just to warm up. Whoops. Just to warm ourselves up and get those buffs down. Um, we want to make it to Trapper's Cabin by tonight. We want to. That's bottom line. We have to. We definitely have to. Alright, it does look like it's calming down, so I'm really tempted just to go ahead and drink the, the coffee. Really? Again? Super lucky I have 18 Tinder on me. Yeah, we're gonna, we want to make, make a good use of our time here, so I think we're going to make two coffees and a roast it. So we'll put all of our uh, teas down. Okay, yeah, no blizzard. That's good. That's the good news. No, it is possible to move if we want to. Um, I am, however, going to put both of those down and our rose hip tea. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I mean, on the way over here, when it looked like it was going to blizzard again, I was super, super tempted to run back to the the gas station but i'm really glad i didn't right now i'm really glad we didn't so that's good okay um you know it's not ideal it's really just not ideal but i think we just have to go i think we have to go let's do it that was an instant blowout that's fine all right let's go we're, we're gonna drink the we're gonna drink the coffee first most definitely. Uh, let's go ahead and drink the coffee now. Wherever the coffee is. There, drink that. We do have um, the wind coming out of the wall here. So, in theory, it should be a little warmer. Oh, no, it's coming from the side. Yikes. Okay. I did pick up the, uh, the rabbit skins, right? I did, I did pick those up, right? I'm not going to check now. I think, I think we picked them up. I don't know. That's a good question. Um, we really can't stop for anything right now. It's super cold. Oh, it's nice in the windshade though. Look at that. One down. Okay, did we pick up the rabbits? Yes, we did. Okay, great. I really thought we didn't there. 
Um, that would have been super unfortunate. Um, to get or not to get these rabbits, right? That is the question. Um, I'm going to drink the rose hip tea. I know it sounds a little silly, but I need as much warmth as we can get back. Oh, that's good. Got a lot of warmth there. Try to stay behind these trees as long as possible. I'll even take a few of these as well. All right. Um, I don't hear a wolf down here, nor do I see one. So I'm right now. I'm really just gonna hope that this weather calms down, and so we can climb the rope. Um, in my personal opinion, right now, I think we'll be okay. I think we'll be okay. We're gonna use the coffee, I think, before we climb the next rope. So hopefully it does stay hot. If it doesn't, maybe we start a quick fire. I don't know. I'll take the rose hips. Okay. Let's get in here. There is a bed in here, actually. Oh, no, there's not. That was just a dead person. My apologies, sir. I mistaken you for a... Oh, wood matches. Let's go. Oh, my gosh. That makes me so much more confident in our future. <laughs> you guys have no idea. Okay. That's awesome. That's really awesome. I'm going to go ahead and drink... Can I drink the other coffee? Yes, let's do it. Get some warmth back, get some energy back, and we'll press on towards Mystery Lake here. Got to try not to sprint, though. Take the flare out as well. Uh, how, how are we looking for weight right now? 61? Yeah. Unfortunately, we can't take these rabbits. It, not the time, not the place. We'll go ahead and take the rabbits, though, um, at Trappers. That's definitely something I want to do. Um, it'd almost be silly not to. Come on. Alright, let's get up this rope here. It's super cold for the time of day, man. Why is it so cold? Thankfully, we have our heat buff, but my gosh, you know, if we didn't have it, what would happen, right? I mean, I, I think I know what would happen, but all right, we have lots of energy left over, so that's always good. I'm just going to, I'm sprinting right now just to get behind these rocks. That way we can get wind shaded faster. Probably shouldn't be sprinting on this narrow, narrow bridge, but it's fine. Okay, great. Nice and, nice and shaded for now. Man, the, the weather does some wonky stuff in Dead Man, I tell ya. At least it's a tailwind. That's, that's all you can uh, that's all you can do, really. That's good. That's good. Uh, usually there's sticks over there. I'm not really going to get them. I just want to get behind this rock. There we go. Nice. And sometimes there's even cattails on this little river. So we should go ahead and look for those. Keep an eye out. That's always good. Man, what an intense episode. I did not go into this thinking it would be this intense. Whoops. Take that. Very unpredictable. But that is the, the mode we are playing, you know? In both of these... I will absolutely take any cattails. Cattails are such a currency in this game. Amazing. They're awesome. Alright, we're still windshaded. We're good. Stick to the rocks. Getting a little colder. I think we should be okay, though. Nice tailwind, I must say. Alright. Grab these. I think the cave... Yep, that's the cave. Awesome, guys. Oh, boy. Wowie wow. That's all I gotta say. Wow, wow, and wow. Oh, my. All right, uh, let's just run it in, I think we're okay. 
Well, I'm hoping this cave's warm, but if it's not, we can combat that. Oh, boy. All right. Saving. We're in the cave. Transition between Mountain Town and Mystery Lake. Wow. Oh, my gosh. I tell you, what? Just what an adventure that was. Just the last hour. Oof. Crazy, crazy, crazy. But we're up to the, the hour mark here, so I think I'm going to end it. Um, next episode, we're going to keep struggling <laughs> to survive anyway. Um... Hopefully we can get to the trapper's cabin okay. It seems like on my screen, it seems bright enough that I can get through this cave without lighting a torch. So I might go ahead and do that, but it looks like we were cooling down pretty, yeah. We're not warm enough in this cave. So looks like we might even have to start a fire too. So, but those are all problems for next episode. So if you guys made it this far, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I hope to see you all in the next episode.